Today at 10 a.m. I was just chilling, having my coffee at the coffee shop, trying to relax before my nails appointment that was at 11. And then all of a sudden I receive a call. My agent called me to tell me that I am booked for the job and I need to be at the airport in two hours. <laughs> When I received the call, I was literally half awake and I didn't know what to do first because I had my nails appointment and my facial appointment that I either had to cancel or at least go to my nail appointment, get my manicure done and then figure out a way to pack in 15 minutes and go to the airport immediately. So yeah, today I ended up in Spain. This was very unexpected, but... Here we are. I'm gonna be here for the next five days. Um, I'm shooting from Tuesday to Friday and then I'm leaving on Saturday. The job that I'm doing is for Pull and Bear. I did work with them before and it's always fun to come back and work with them once again. So I wanted to bring you guys along with me as always on my work adventures. I thought I was going to rest this week, but I guess that's not gonna happen. And don't get me wrong, I'm super grateful I got booked for this job. I love working for this brand. And even though it was so last minute and unexpected, I'm really glad I'm here and that I'm gonna spend some time here for the next few days. I arrived to my hotel at 10 o'clock, which is kind of late. Now it's 11.30. I wash my hair, I shower, prepare for tomorrow for my photo shoot. Gotta wake up at 6.15, I think, because we're leaving at 7.15. The driver is picking up me and some other models. They're shooting for the brand. I'm gonna try to have a quick breakfast in the morning. They open up, I think, at 7 a.m. So I'll probably have 10 to 15 minutes to either grab a coffee or something to eat and we always have breakfast at the studio and we have lunch provided so we're gonna have a bunch of stuff there drinks coffee food everything i just want to begin this vlog here and explain to you guys what's going on i'm super tired i need to rest it's gonna be a long week but i'll see you guys tomorrow morning <laughs> Good morning guys, I just finished doing my skincare, it's 6.40, I'm gonna head downstairs very soon, I just need to get dressed. I already packed my bag for today, yesterday night. I'm not bringing much, I'm gonna bring this little bag, I just have a few things that can keep me entertained whenever we have a lunch break or any kind of break throughout the day. I actually started using Kindle again because I bought this long time ago i already bring so much stuff with me and then to bring books on top of everything is just too much okay now i need to choose what i'm gonna wear i don't even know what i packed considering i had only 15 minutes to pack yesterday i even managed to pack workout clothes and my workout shoes i honestly don't know when i'm gonna have the time or the energy to work out but <laughs> i got dressed i'm ready to go i'm gonna head downstairs now to the breakfast area and see what they have. Probably I'm gonna have a tea.
guys, I'm back at the hotel. My first work day here is finished. Honestly, today was super easy because we were doing more creative shots. It wasn't just like boring e-com. So today went by super fast. Probably tomorrow we're gonna do e-com for all of these looks that we shot today. So I need to get a few things that I forgot to bring. I need cotton pads and stuff like that. So I was thinking to go to Sephora and some other stores they have here. It's about 15 minute walk. Today is a beautiful sunny day here so I feel like I'm gonna enjoy this little walk. I am a bit tired but I can go to bed early tonight because as soon as I get back to the hotel I'm gonna shower, get ready for bed, and go to sleep. All right, let's go. guys washed my hair did my skincare showered i feel so nice right now that walk was super nice and i got what i needed i don't know if i should show you guys what i got because it's so random it's literally the things that i needed there's actually one product that could be interesting but i guess i can just show you everything why not so i forgot cotton pads and that's the main thing that i had to get then i got this face mask i actually tried it out before whenever i travel for work i try to bring a face mask with me or just buy it at the airport because after a day or multiple days of having makeup on all day it's super nice to hydrate my skin and this one is very soothing it calms down my skin i got some razors because i forgot mine that i use all the time i personally don't really love these ones because i cut myself quite often and i feel like they're too sharp i always use men razors and they're the best because i never cut myself and they're very gentle on the skin i got this big pack because they didn't sell individual ones and the last product over here is this this got to be glued for brows and edges i really wanted to try this one out myself because they always use it on me whenever i have photo shoots a lot of makeup artists love it i usually use anastasia beverly hills um brow gel but i want to try something different now i'm feeling super tired and i'm ready to go to bed i gotta wake up early tomorrow again and we have three more days of photo shoots so i definitely will need a lot of rest so i'm gonna say goodbye for tonight and i'll see you guys tomorrow morning good morning guys it's the next day currently it's 6 39 i'm gonna head out in five minutes got dressed, got ready. I had eight and a half hours of sleep, which is amazing because now I'm ready for the day. I'm not tired. <laughs> Today I'm flying back home. The car is gonna pick me up in about an hour. 
I'm finishing packing up. I already had my breakfast this morning and it's time to go home. Yesterday was my last work day here and the shoot was super short. We finished, I think, at 12.30. I thought we were gonna shoot till three o'clock because Fridays are always half days whenever I shoot for this brand. So I was pretty happy about that yesterday that we finished so early and then I went to town, I went to Sephora and a couple other stores because I had to get a few products again. Came back to the hotel pretty early and then I just showered, got ready for bed and I was just chilling here. One thing about me, I can sleep a lot and I love sleeping. Some people hate sleeping, they just want to get up and start doing things and being productive or just enjoying their day. But me, I could sleep for so long. On my third day here, um, the third day of the photo shoot, I haven't filmed anything because we do pretty much the same thing every single day. We either shoot something more like editorial, like they call it image, or we shoot classic econ, which is very boring to watch. So that's what we shot on the third day. The team is wonderful as always. I always work with the same team of photographers, stylists and makeup artists because they have multiple models come in throughout the week. Some models stay for three days, some for two days, some for four days. It all depends and each model usually works with the same team if they have been here before But it does happen that certain people from the team from your usual team are not available So they will have to get in someone else, but usually they will stick with one team that works well together I don't think I actually told you guys what my day looks like there in terms of the timing like when do i have breaks and everything so the first time i was working for them i was so confused because i thought we're gonna be just very high paced and we have a lot of looks to shoot because usually when you shoot econ for brands it will be up to a hundred looks sometimes and i did shoots like that before so in those cases we have to respect the timings on our schedule for example if the schedule says the makeup is from eight to nine it cannot be any longer than that it can be just shorter so you have to finish your makeup and hair by nine o'clock and you start shooting immediately maybe you have a little break to go to the toilet or something but you have to be on set starting at 9. But here, it works a little bit differently. So we arrive around 8 o'clock. We drink coffee and just chat for 30 minutes. We start our makeup and hair. We finish at 9.40. Sometimes a bit earlier, depends on the model. Because sometimes there's a lot more work with the hair or makeup. Because we all have different makeup and hair. They don't do the same makeup and hair on everyone. And then we start shooting around 10 and then at 11 we have a small coffee break which is 10 to 15 minutes but usually we take like 30 minutes. So nothing is very strict and precise in terms of the timing throughout the day. They're super, super relaxed, which is very rare. And we would shoot max 20 looks, which is insane because usually e-com is at least, let's say if it's a full day, 60 pieces. Like no brand that I have worked for would do less than that because they just want to shoot as much as they can. But I guess because every single girl has a certain type of clothes they shoot. For example, this week I was shooting only denim. So I'm the girl for denim. The other girl was for dresses, more elegant pieces. And then the third girl, I was not sure, maybe she was shooting loungewear or something like that. So for example, if they have not more than 30 pieces all together for the whole week, they cannot shoot 60 pieces a day or more than that. But usually when I work for other brands that I shot like 60 to 100, I shoot everything. I shoot dresses, I shoot beachwear, I shoot loungewear, any piece of clothing they have on their website basically. And yeah, after that little break we have in the morning, then we have a lunch break from 1.30 till 2.30, but usually we take hour and a half, not just an hour, because they also need to fix my makeup and hair after lunch. But sometimes we will finish early because we don't have any more looks to shoot. <laughs> for example, yesterday I was supposed to have a half day till 3 o'clock, 
but we finished at 12 30. now i'm gonna finish packing um i'm gonna pack my skincare and everything i have in the bathroom i think pretty much everything else is already in my suitcase i have so much time left till my car is here so i think i'm gonna just go downstairs check out and wait at the lounge area because I don't know i just want to stay in this room it's pretty dark as well and today is raining and it's gloomy and it's not the best weather in the past few days it was sunny beautiful out i'm not sure i'm gonna film anything else for today to be honest i'm just traveling all day nothing interesting so that's the end of this vlog i hope you enjoyed it um i always love to bring you guys along with me on my work adventures this one was pretty spontaneous and very last minute but oh well i'm always gonna grab the camera and vlog everything i have some fun things coming up this month so i'm gonna film everything for you guys and i will see you very very soon in my next vlog